hey guys welcome back to my channel we're going to do some makeup because i literally don't be going anywhere so wow mommy open opening this okay so we're gonna get this started i have no idea what my look is going to be but i do have an outfit to show you guys because my outfit is kind of cute that i wore today so you know we're gonna do that I'm going to start off with this Invisible Undercover Primer Marc Jacobs. But I feel like I feel like last year as well I did a makeup video that was around the same time I don't, I don't know i know it was in january and it was like i did like a video about the year hold on you guys should come closer and that was about the year and stuff i know it's took cute pictures i remember that for sure but yeah i don't really Sometimes these days, I don't really have the urge to wear makeup. And it's funny because the girlies on TikTok be doing makeup. And I'm just like, it just looks so good. And I want to, but I just can't. Okay. I cannot. So yeah, I'm just gonna do my brows and I'm using edge control. I was gonna go to get that, um, what's it called? I've been wanting to get, not the Anastasia one, but I guess that's what it is, the brow thing. But Elf came out with one and it's like $6, but it's sold out. And the only place that's not sold out is like the opposite like direction from like where, like when I'm coming home from work, I would have to like go past my house and go 40 minutes like out of the way. and. I was just not in the mood to, to do that today. I was just trying to come home. It's just snow. We had a snowstorm, so I was not in the mood to go all the way down there. And I don't particularly like going to that shopping center ever since something happened there. So, um, you know, it's so weird because like things happen and like. Hysteria. I don't know if that's the word. Be able to film this video without any interruptions. We shall see. I like struggle with my brows, and it's so funny because like my brows, like when I look back on like pictures and stuff, my brows are just looking really good. But yeah, I wanted to get the brow freeze from Elf, but it's sold out. And like the bajillion stores like where I work at, it's not there. Other places, it's not there. And as we discussed, I'm not going out of the way to get it. Like the place is closer to my house, but like when I'm coming from home, it's not close. I mean, when I'm coming home from work, it's not close. Because from my house, my work is like 30 minutes. I mean like... 40 minutes to an hour this way and then the other place is like 40 minutes to an hour the opposite direction from my house it just it doesn't work out but i was like i was on lunch and i was trying to figure out if there were any places close that i could go but they weren't um so yeah I'm going with Morphe Mocha and which is like a warmer shade and then Java which is like a darker shade. It looks like the Anastasia color that everyone and their mom be using. But yeah, it's a new year. I did another vision board this year. I did one, actually kind of have two, but um, I did a vision board and, um, 
I wrote down goals. I feel like my goals are like not all over the place this year. It's like centered around one thing. So that's pretty cool. Um, and what else? Yeah, pretty much just that. Um, it was interesting because like at the beginning of the year, like, was it the first? I think the first it rained and I, I love rain. I don't like love rain. Like I love rain for like the comfort of my home and like rainy days. I don't exactly like love rain, you know? So I was like, oh, it's cleansing all the last year stuff. But also I'm mean, the kind of person right now who's like, oh, like new year, but like you can continue on. For next year, like, it's not just January 1st and, like, everything changes. I mean, people do that because, like, people do go to the gym more often and stuff. When the year... Actually, I might just leave this, like, how it is. And not go in with the other color. Just because... Yeah, I'm gonna leave it the way it is. I'm not gonna... Do... Anything else with it. We're just gonna leave it like <laughs> So I'm not using Java. I'm just keeping Mocha. But yeah, I had goals and stuff. Where I have goals and stuff that obviously. Why do I have two mix foundings? Oh, I bought two. Okay, is it me? Okay, never mind. I see why. I'll have to say something, but like, I don't really make sense. So, I'm gonna go in with Cacao from NYX. I love NYX products, okay? And I also love, there's another concealer that I haven't done yet. So, I also love Too Faced because of like just the way it's creamy, but like NYX, I mean, wow, NYX. NARS is like, where did my mirror go? Okay. NARS is like lightweight and like this. I love the um, Too Faced one. I literally just got it like the, last year towards like the end. I went to like the uh, cosmetic store and they were on sale and I was like, I'll try it. Cause I literally only buy makeup. Mm, for the most part, like I did go to a Sephora the end of last year, like not December, but the end. And I um, purchased literally you cannot film i purchased makeup i think what did i get i don't even remember what i got oh i got this concealer that i'm using was it this one yeah i already got monday so i got this concealer that i'm using and um no, my battery dying. Even though I like literally just plugged it in yesterday and used it once. I think I need to get another battery. Like purchase one if I'm like actually going to use this. Cause how? Or I just need to plan out my filming better. But yeah, I got this concealer and I got something else. I was looking for something. Oh, I was trying to get a brow product from milk but they didn't have the shade and i don't remember if it was this time or oh and i got like um soul de janeiro perfume did i get something else i don't remember um but yeah i usually buy makeup for the most part i will get my makeup at like marshall's i used to like tj maxx but mostly i just go to marshall's now i don't really go to tj maxx that often um, yeah, and right now I kind of have a lot of makeup, so I'm not really buying makeup. I bought, like, that concealer, obviously, but I'm not really, like, buying makeup like that. So, there's no need. And I'm not really doing my makeup like that. So there's also no need. Like, I feel like I should, like, get rid of some of my makeup. Low-key. Just because there's products that, like, I no longer reach for. Or at least like organize it. I don't know. I don't know. 
Am I gonna do anything to my eyes today? Really sure. We'll see how long this battery lasts. So, I don't even know what I was talking about. I'm just so sorry. But, I want to use, I want to use this. I, I bought this thinking like it was a paint pot for the eyes, but it's a, um, it's not that it's legit a color corrector which and i got two of them because i got like i ended up getting like they was having a sale it's always they were having a sale um but they were having a sale and i got a free item so i just got another like paint pot i don't always color correct to be honest because it's like we'd be going full coverage over here i feel like i only color correct if i'm going to go like if i don't want to put a lot of product on my face But I feel like I'm not gonna lie. I'm I don't know if I've talked about this in a video before, but I'm definitely one of those people who like I feel like I want to look like I could go out. Like let's say like there's like I don't know, like for instance, you live in a dorm, right? Like and you just have me doing your makeup. I want to like every step of my makeup to be like at the point where like if I was to go outside, like I wouldn't be looking crazy. You get what I'm saying? At any stuff I'm gonna make. Obviously, that's like hard for like baking because it happens. But like, that's the goal. So, not that's my goal, please. But I also like changed how I do makeup to, to a certain extent. I used to be a whole coverage girl. I low key am now. Sometimes I'll dabble in the whole concealer thing, like just concealer. But I want to be able to go out and like, I don't know, I can't tell. Like right now I don't feel like I look crazy. I feel like around my mouth looks more even, my eyebrows or whatever. But for the most part, even though now I feel like I do dabble in that, I am kind of full coverage because I kind of like will always do my makeup or not. Like there's sometimes where I'll just wear lashes just because like I feel like I look bare. Like, but the lashes that I have or that I did look like um, lash extensions. So, but we are definitely a all or nothing girl for the most part. And I'm using NARS because, like, I don't. I feel like the only reason, I'm not gonna lie to y'all, the only reason that I keep buying makeup is so that I have like makeup that goes together if that makes sense like makeup like i had my nars foundation and concealers okay hold on does this even fit me any hmm, i'm about to find out um i feel like when i got this done too the lady was like oh your skin's gonna get she was either like oh your skin's gonna get lighter or it's gonna get darker but i forget that and this is literally the like I do go full coverage, but I think I go with my foundation more than, I mean, I feel like I go full coverage with my concealer. Like I'll put foundation just for like even purposes, but like, oh. And I forget if this oxidizes, that's probably why I got this color. But I like bronze contour. People use that interchangeably. But I like warm up my face, so it'll be all right. Oh, I literally saw this video yesterday of this girl who like just didn't put foundation on her forehead, so we're gonna try that today. You know, it's a punk early. Not me trying to like make sure that all my face is covered because there literally is a video where I don't do that. And looks oh, weird. So the girls out here are doing um Oh, yeah, I basically have a foundation and a concealer. Almost every foundation that I have almost has a concealer to it, like from the same one. So we're going to use this, which 
this is a caffeinated concealer in medium it's funny i bought this and then like i bought this when i went to atlanta and i don't know if i'd like release in Atlanta vlog or not but um i bought this when i got to atlanta because i was just like oh it'll be so brightening and then literally like now the trend is in for um you know the girls doing doing where's the other one this trend which i had this too i had this for something else though i had it to like not use it as a concealer i think to like cut my crease i don't remember but like now it's in to do that and even though i did but this one was on my face more the is that more cheekups yeah the caffeinated concealer i've been using that like as a concealer but i think i wanted to use it like in tandem with something else just to like make all my other concealers darker again like i said i've been buying makeup but it's like not like how much i've bought makeup before like i've been buying makeup to go with the makeup or make the makeup make the makeup that i already have work like i think because i have like foundations that i used to use as contours that are darker so i bought this so that like it would so i could use it with those foundations and therefore like somehow make like my highlight look like my skin tone is so weird but i'm back and this is the look um what do i do i'm just gonna go like this and just you know placement is everything doggy um oh also one of my favorite things about doing my makeup now well not things is legit this one's dirty but like if you see this one this is the Sony. this one's dirty too they all dirty um the sonia kashuk beauty blenders love them love them so i'm just going to i don't know do i want to set yeah mm, i don't know if i want to go in and um contour no, we'll do that. We're gonna go contour first. And then, or either bring some definition to the face or not. I'm not really sure. So, I haven't literally used. Ooh, thank you. I have literally not used this in forever. This is a contour because it's on um, shadowy, it's not bringing depth. And then, it, it's just gone. Uh, also, I need to like figure out a filming setup if I'm gonna be filming because sometimes I just don't be filming because I mean I don't want to and <laughs> that's like the honest truth either because I don't want to or like just trying to figure out like what look good on a camera or just trying to figure out like where to go because like this girly over here does not have a filming setup like I do not have like a permanent background that i will film in like which is why i'm most likely to do vlogs um yeah which is probably why i'm most likely to do vlogs where i'm not filming inside my home so there's that oh also i was one of i was one of the people then that were over here talking about they weren't gonna download tiktok or whatever and i downloaded it and I love it. I don't know, cause like, I feel like TikTok is different for everyone because of like how you create your feet. My feet is very melanated. It's very much lifestyle. Some of the luxury girls are on there. Not really a lot, perfume sometimes. I feel like it was just like, oh, a lot of cooking videos. Cause I do cooking videos. Wow. Not like I do cooking videos, like I'm out here like, oh, I do cooking videos. But I do do some. Um, and I like I like watching like the calm cooking videos. That's a good thing for me. I feel like this is a product so I'm gonna put some face powder so that it's black it doesn't. But I started more recently doing like vlogs because it just works for me. And some of the vlogs will end up here on YouTube but it's just easier to do them on TikTok. 
it's easier. Um, there was some makeup videos I put on there, some wig videos of me like doing a wig or whatever. Also, ignore this because it probably looks like this because this brush already had product, like I said. Like I should. So we're going to go in. Do I want to go in with this? I don't know if I want to go in with this to be honest. But yeah, I feel like I just like doing my makeup with you guys because if I'm doing my makeup like before I go to work, because I don't really have to wear makeup to go to work, like sometimes I'll just do it. Like when I was in school, like when I was in high school and stuff, in middle school, and even like in college, I didn't have to wear makeup to go to class, but it was just part of my routine and I just do well when I have a routine. Like it just works better for me when I have a routine life just goes more smoothly for me so yeah but I feel like I'm rushed sometimes and then when I do it with you guys it doesn't matter because like I'm about to wash this off like I'm not going anywhere for the most part so it doesn't matter okay I don't know if this nose contour is gonna do what it needs to do to be honest it's okay I feel like I'll be it we're gonna get it looking how it's supposed to look and then I'm going to try something <laughs> do not come, trust the process okay trust the process because I don't know where this is about to go but we're gonna do something I'm going to put a little bit of not blush is this thing which I have made I don't know if I've made like a I've used it in a vlog I believe before but yeah we're gonna use that and I need to wash my beauty blenders but again I'm not doing makeup that often so still not an excuse they should be ready they just if this comes out good <laughs> trust the process because i just i'm using a tiny mirror i'm trying my darndest i feel like this one's a little too high not too high but it doesn't match see i just i'd be bringing out the camera and getting experimental with y'all and just being like oh let's try okay that looks kind of weird because it's like I mean, it looks like a natural blush or whatever, but as you can see, we're just winging it at this point. Um, so I'm just going to go and set, set, set the work we did. Um, and I using, this is, I need to get more, uh, I have setting powder, but I just love this one better. Like, like I said, I was making videos on TikTok with makeup videos and all the makeup videos if you go check it out maybe i'll leave my TikTok down below um wow all the videos like my makeup looks like a hell of a brush which is really funny because in this video i look like i don't know how to do makeup but they look flawless i promise you those other videos and it's I use the powder and look there's this one video where I think I have a blonde wig on now I know for sure I have a blonde wig on and it just looks flawless what is happening here what is this chaos but yeah this powder is saving grace it's funny because I feel like it doesn't look that bad like it probably does the lighting can be the same but yeah, this powder is amazing and it's super cheap. Brush, best drugstore setting powder. And I just put some like spray on it, but if you use it, yo, if you wet your beauty blender and you use this, it's amazing. It is amazing. It'll fix everything. I don't know if it's gonna fix this nose contour situation. 
but it like smooths out the skin so flawlessly. It's unbelievable. And okay, so let's go in with some powders to bring this. I don't even know where we're bringing it to at this point. But we're gonna figure it out and it's gonna be okay. Um, Born This Way powders. See, even now, like my skin, look my under eye looks so good with the elf powder. Under it, it just looks good. Especially if you like, I don't know, when my skin was not, like my skin's pretty okay now. Just because I've been like skin caring more or whatever. But like when I wasn't, oh my gosh. Like I love that like airbrushed look, the very soft look. And I have a video on here, if you haven't seen it, it's um of me doing like my makeup to take Instagram pictures and it's because I don't want to do pictures. Is it because I'm lazy or what? I don't know, but if you are not great with adding your pictures, go check out that makeup video. And it'll help you I feel like I just like getting so discouraged with doing my makeup at this point because it doesn't come out like what it used to and then I'll like go watch the TikToks and stuff over again. And it doesn't look the same and I'm just like what the heck? Like what the heck? Like the nose contour used to be snatched and all that. And now I just feel like it's not the same. It's not the same. Or maybe my face has changed. Maybe I'm just because I'm putting on weight. So like maybe my face is just like I'm not used to doing my face anymore. And maybe. I don't know. Maybe I'm just legit making excuses. Okay. Alright. I'm going to, I feel like I should just like, this is it. This is literally the makeup look. Um, it's just shopping. Or I just should have to be cutting up my lip. I feel like I used to like doing like I tried to fix it. <laughs> I mean it came together. It don't look too bad. We're gonna put up this um Maybelline gloss that has hyaluronic acid in it. It's called Ice. Ice like me. So literally all I did it was put like highlighter right there to just separate it and then I put on my lashes and pretty 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 girl and I'm literally putting on gloss right now because uh can't put on a gloss when you wear a mask I literally told you guys I was um going to do makeup Because I don't be doing makeup because I just sometimes I just don't be in the mood to be doing it. But yeah, that under eye is bright. Okay, let me show you guys the full fit. Well, not like the full full fit, but like the full. I'm not sure. Maybe. So this LRG hat. That's so very special. Oh, one thing I don't miss about gloss is and then this Forever 21 jacket, which I've literally been naming. We're gonna call this Melanin Mocha. Okay. And it doesn't have a hood, so I like to wear it with the hats or hoodies. Okay, just you see the vibes. I swear I had spectacles over here, which was not part of the outfit that I wore. 
today, but pretty, pretty girls all over the world. And then I literally just got on these like olive green. It's a very neutral fit. It's a neutral fit. But yeah, if you made it this far in the video, that's great because it's been chaotic. If you can't tell, I'm rusty. Yeah, um, I will just leave my TikTok one down below because those makeup videos are better than this one. But yeah. I'll probably be uploading more vlogs and like makeup videos. Okay, because I'm struggling. I'm rusty. But I hope you enjoyed it. Um and I'll see you guys in the next video. Whatever that is. It's probably already filmed and I just need to edit it. Oh my gosh, I don't know what it is. Low key though, low key high key. This nose contour thing that I did, like my nose actually looks really cute though. Like it's giving like it's giving plastic surgery. It's giving makeup over plastic surgery. Not, not. Yeah, but it's it's low key snatched. That's why, yo, I saw this trend where like someone just put like contour all over their nose and then they went in with like, um, like highlight. Kind of like the opposite of what I did. But low key, I'm loving it. I should take some pictures because. Oh yeah, thank you for watching this video. I love you guys. Happy New Year to all of you. And I'll see you in the next one. Yes, baby girl. Yes.